So, I've been hearing so much about remote sensing, and I want to do it too. Well, you need to have a question in mind first, an environmental problem that needs answering. Ah, okay. Well maybe I want to make a map of this whole area. Well it's a pretty big area if you include the mountains as well. So maybe 100,000 square K. What sort of features would you like to map? What's the smallest feature? I think that a general map of land cover to start with would be good. So perhaps with the vegetation, grasses, bare ground etc. The smallest feature might be a park, perhaps 10,000 square. That makes sense. So now we have information about the area to cover, the amount of detail required, and the types of features of interest. What time of year would you like the map to represent? Is it important to capture wet or dry seasons, or summer or winter, for example? Well, wet season might be better to look at vegetation while it's green. But then it's often cloudy which isn't good for satellite images. Perhaps I should look at the change between the wet and the dry season? That sounds like a great idea. So you've identified your information requirements, the next step is to identify a sensor that can meet your needs. So, I need to cover 100,000 square K. My smallest feature is 10,000 square meters. I'm interested in vegetation, and the change between the wet and the dry seasons. So that means you need a scene size of more than 100,000 square K, and a pixel size of much less than 10,000 square meters. As a rule of thumb, we say that you need a pixel size of less than one-tenth the size of the smallest feature of interest, although that's not always achievable. And as I'm interested in vegetation, then I'll need a multi-spectral sensor with a near-infrared band, and perhaps red and mid-infrared too. That's right. They're your spectral requirements. Your temporal resolution requirement will be two per year, to match the wet and dry season. Excellent. I think I have a few options to choose from now. Sounds like Landsat, Spot, and Avnir will all do the job for me. But at least Landsat is free.